So let's go ahead and uh, write your first TypeScript code. I have Visual Studio Code open and I'm gonna go here and you can see that I have this folder, which is TS tutorial. So that's the folder that I have open in Visual Studio Code. So you can click here to create a new file or you can just click on this little icon here and I'm gonna create this file called hello.ts. So the extension is TS because this is a TypeScript file and then I'm gonna press enter. And in here, what I'm going to do is just type in console.log and then I'm going to put open and close parenthesis. And in here, I'm going to say hello world. And then I'm going to end with semicolon. Then I'm going to collapse the explorer. So we only have to see this file right here. And then if you look to the top right corner, I have this little play button here. And I'm just going to go ahead and click it. And you can see I have hello world. So this is a TypeScript file and this is TypeScript code. But if you look at it, you might be thinking, well, this looks exactly like JavaScript. Well, actually it is JavaScript. In JavaScript, you would exactly have the same thing. But the only difference is this is the TypeScript file. So therefore you can see this code is TypeScript code. So in the next lecture, I'm gonna go over some of the configuration and have you install TypeScript on your computer. And then I'm gonna show you how you can make your Visual Studio code if you don't have it already. I'll show you where to download it and I'm going to show you how to configure it so that you can run your TS files or your TS code or TypeScript code inside of the VS code ID itself so that you don't have to go use the browser. And this is the setup that we're going to use throughout the course so that we can see everything in one window. So we're going to write our code on the left and then we're going to run our code and see the output on the right.